Hello and welcome to Learn It All. In our previous video, we learned to create our AWS account. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to host your static website on AWS with easy and simple steps using Elastic Beanstalk. On the search bar, look for Elastic Beanstalk. There it is. Click on it and then click on create application give a name to your application i'm just gonna say uh, new website and then we have to create a platform so because we are hosting a static website we can pick any of these so for now i'm just gonna pick um tomcat and we can leave it alone and uh, these are the best selected options and the next step is to upload your code select the upload your code and we are going to upload a local file so what that means is that you should be having your website locally available to you so i have mine available to me here that's my website and if I open the website, okay, that's my website. Okay. And it's running locally from my computer. And I want to host this on Amazon Web Services. Okay, so the next step would be to. So, what I'm basically doing is I would be uploading all of this to AWS by Elastic Beanstalk. So for that, first we need to create a zip. So right click and send to a zip folder. And that is the file that we need to upload to Elastic Beanstalk. All right, we go back to the AWS uh, console and we choose the file select the zip file that we just created and click on open and that's the name of the source that's going to be uploaded you can change it or you can just leave it alone the next step would be to click on configure more options and make sure that single instance which is free is selected otherwise you might get charged if any of these are selected so just make sure that you have a single instance checked and we don't need to change anything here right now and go ahead and create our app so it's creating the environment right now this is going to take a few minutes all right seems our upload was successful and you can see that the link above here that's actually the link to your website let's open that congratulations your website can now be accessed by public that is it for today guys see you in the next video and don't forget to like subscribe and click the bell icon for instant notification on new videos